What's up guys, it's your Wolfing Messiah. So as you saw by the title of this video, I'm going to be taking you through a full day in quarantine self-isolation, whatever you want to call it, right? So as you saw at the beginning of the video, I had an online class from 8.50 to 10.30 and that was my biology class. Um, so just on there, we were getting work on there, like the PowerPoints were being uploaded and we could talk to our teachers. Uh, we were doing it on like Microsoft Teams, which is a really good software. But yeah, I've got another class at 11.40. So before then, I'm going to go get something to eat, show you guys what I'm eating. So as I said, I'm going to take you through a full day in the live stream, everything I'm doing, pretty much everything I'm eating and everything I'm doing to kind of like stay sane during this time because obviously staying at home for a prolonged period of time people can often you know go a bit crazy so I'm showing you everything I'm doing to kind of keep myself busy and just all the things I'm doing so and I've got no shortage of things that I could be doing uh, I'm trying to get out my home workout plan um, that will be going up very soon I've already started working on it and it should be done by the end of this week so hopefully when this is uploaded maybe a couple of days later it should be up so make sure you look up for that if you're watching this video a bit later so and I'll put a link to where you can buy that when it's up in the description so Alright guys, so what we've got for breakfast is some leftover barbecue chicken uh, mixed up with three eggs and some spinach, uh, mix that all up, and two slices of uh, whole grain toast. Um, I like to have pretty um, high protein breakfast. So with my diet now, I've changed it from not only being like kind of a maintenance, but maybe a slight calorie deficit, and because of that, up my protein, uh, I do want to get a little bit leaner. Um, I know that I'm training at home, uh, so it's not going to be exact same as the gym. So I do run the risk of losing a bit of muscle, but any muscle that I do lose, uh, I'll definitely gain back within a couple of weeks of coming back to the gym. And this time off is going to be used to kind of heal some of those aches and pains that I've got um, from squatting. It's not something bad now, in the, although I can feel it coming back sometimes. But I'd say around the beginning of the year, around January time, I used to have really bad pain in my hips. Uh, that I got from squatting because um, with squatting uh, I was going for PRs every week and getting PRs every week but I guess that constant load on my body you know my hips just couldn't keep up with it so I got really I was getting really bad pain in my hips whenever I'd sit down for you know any longer than about like 10-20 minutes um, so that is going away now because obviously I'm not squatting so but I'm going to show you guys in another video what I'm doing for legs but either way yeah um, today I'm also going to take you through a home workout that I'm doing because I'm working at our home I do have access to a pair of dumbbells um, that go up to around I could probably load about 25 kg on each dumbbell at the very max and I do have access to a, a bench um, an adjustable bench press so um, I'm gonna take you for a workout today's probably gonna be a more of a shoulder and arm focus because you can see that the workout that I did that I posted in the video previously if you haven't seen it you can watch it up there um, that was more of a chest and a um, back focus but this one is gonna be more of an arm and shoulder focus so yeah I'm gonna eat this breakfast um, and then I will probably it'll probably be time for my next online class if it's happening um, so yeah, take you through that. And I'll also be washing that down with some cranberry juice, juice of champions. I think Eddie Hall drank liters and liters of this when he was going for his 500 kilo deadlift. So, I mean, it must mean something. So, uh, yeah. This is a Chucky Beat production. Alright guys, so it's about 10 to 2 now. I finished the lion's share of my studying and stuff I've done. Pretty much all my lesson time for today. I may do some extra studying later on in the evening. Um, but now, I'm going to make myself another meal. After that, I will probably uh, chill for a bit. Then get a workout in. And then after that, I've got to do some work on my um, training plans, trying to get those up. And then after that, uh, we can chill. Um, the weather outside is very nice, um, which is a bit disappointing, seeing as we have to be indoors right now. Uh, but uh, I saw this funny thing on the internet, with this guy saying that the government is controlling the weather because this, it goes sunny as soon as we have to all be indoors, which makes absolutely positively no sense, but you know, people always have their conspiracy theories and uh, yeah. And why, why, why would it be in the government's interest for, 
for it to be sunny when we're inside like why would that be of benefit to the government i don't get it like does the government have like is it for bants like are they having a bit of a laugh i don't really get it but people think what they want to think either way um yeah all right guys i'm gonna have a little bit of mango i already ate a little piece this mango doesn't look the best today uh, i don't know why this mango didn't come out good it looks a bit um it's a bit beaten up but uh, yeah i'm gonna have some of this uh as i wait for my chips in the oven to cook i'm gonna have steak and chips i cooked some steak the other day i don't even know where it's in there somewhere to cook some steak the other day have got some chips and yeah i don't know if you can tell but i'm trying to eat a little bit healthier um you see my other vlogs uh you know a good bit of mcdonald's uh what else just lots of other you know not very clean foods and i still eat that sometimes but i don't eat mcdonald's obviously because um my doors is closed for who knows how long but I've been cleaning up my diet a little bit trying to get some more fruits vegetables in there not as much junk and that is more so because I have a really big appetite and some of those you know cheat type foods uh, are not very calorie dense you get a lot of calories and not a lot of food um, but if you were to eat more healthier foods you could eat a lot more of them um, and you would feel more full because they're just more satiating, they've got more fibre, they fill up your stomach more, they have a bigger volume. So yeah, if you're someone that like struggles with appetite, I'd say cutting out a lot of the um, you know processed foods, not very clean foods, which is going to help you because those are the foods that have a lot of calories and don't really fill you up that much. So yeah. Alright guys, so for lunch we've got a stick I cooked a couple of days ago. Uh, we've got some chips and got some ketchup and stuff. Uh, I'm gonna eat this down. It's probably be a pre-workout meal. But yeah, this and then it's workout time. All right, guys. So I just got done being on live stream with my crackhead friend Vanessa. Um, that was a funny live. If you guys joined it, it was funny. But uh, I'm gonna go do my workout now. As I said, it's gonna be shoulders, a little bit of chest, mostly arms. Um, I've got some dumbbells. I'll figure out a way to get everything in. And yeah.
All right, guys, so just had a good workout. Um, it was six exercises, as you saw. Pretty drained. Um, I'm gonna go have a shower and then get something to eat for dinner. So, um, yeah. All right, guys, this is what dinner's looking like. Three sausages, some uh, mashed potatoes, vegetables. I've got gravy all over everything. That's why it's brown. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna get this down. I'm gonna have some afterwards, and then I always end off the evening with a protein shake, so, yeah. Alright guys, so it's 11.29 right now, um, update, I've been chilling, watching some boxing videos, I've gotten really into boxing recently, um, if you know the channel The Modern Martial Artist, he like breaks down different boxing videos, different topics, in a really, you know, intriguing way, so I've been watching a lot of his videos, um, I'm not even in focus, alright guys, I'm going to have to be quick because my camera's about to die, but yeah, uh, as I said, I've got some boxing videos, um, and then I had a protein cookie as well. I can't even find the wrapping, but I had one of these. If it wants to focus, yeah, I have one of these. I uh, was chilling. Uh, I'm gonna go to bed in a bit, but I'm gonna have a quick protein shake, probably about two and a half scoops of protein with some water. Uh, my battery's literally about to die. And uh, yeah, there's not much more left to the evening. I've got to do some washing up and that, but I'm not gonna be working that much on my training programs this evening. I'm gonna do a lot of work on that tomorrow because I'm really tired. I've done quite a lot today, to be fair. Like, I know obviously today hasn't been that eventful in terms of like me going places and things like that, but I've got a decent amount of schoolwork done, you know, filming done, I got um, a workout done, and everything like that. So I feel pretty fulfilled for today that I did a decent amount. So, um, yeah. Alright guys, I've just got about two and a bit scoops of chocolate whey protein from my protein. Uh, if you want to purchase anything, you can use my code Nick35 for 35% off. It's going to be on the screen. And I'm going to end off the vlog here. Um, it's been pretty much a day in my life in self-isolation, quarantine, whatever we want to call it. Um, it's not the most interesting compared to like what I would be doing if I wasn't in this situation. But then again, we're not allowed to leave our houses and everything like that. So we're just trying to make the best out of a bad situation. Uh, hoping for this situation to pass over swiftly so we can get back to our normal lives um, so yeah I'm gonna end the video here thank you guys for watching I want you to like and subscribe all that good stuff and I'll see you guys in the future video see you